little challenge for you here, guys. Um, ball striking, one of the most important skills to be good at in golf, but certainly one of the most under-practiced skills in golf. How do you improve your ball striking? One of the difficulties when we're practicing with no feedback of where the ball flight is, is that we can end up thinking about a swing too much, we fiddle too much, and we get a little bit lost in a golf swing. That's certainly a lot of the feedback I've been having with the players that I've been coaching online over the last few weeks. So. I've given a lot of my players some specific tasks to work at and this is what I want you guys to give it a try. I want you to dedicate 5-10 to 10 minutes of your practice time specifically on working on your strike. Okay, so how do you do that? First of all, you've got to know what your strike is. Can you tell if you've hit it more at the toe of the heel or the bottom of the top of the club? Um, some of my players will do that, they'll know if they've hit it out the toe of the club, no problem at all, just the, the, they've had so much feedback over the years, they, they just know what that is. Some of my players have no idea whether they've hit it, out, what part of the club they've hit it out of. So a really simple drill to, to get to know that, which is such an important thing to do, is say I've just um, sprayed the front of my club with some deodorant, which will just leave a residue on the club, so when we hit a shot, it's going to leave a mark of where we've hit it. So when you've hit the shot, I want you to think about where, where did it feel like you hit it out of? Can you tell if it's out the toe of the heel? And then obviously have a look and did, does that, is that the same as what you thought it would be? Um, it's amazing how quickly your brain can understand the feeling and it will adapt and, and know what is a toe strike, what is a heel strike, what is a thin strike feel like, what is a, a, a top of the club strike feel like. Um, so once you, get to know those different feelings. I want you to then consciously try to hit it out the toe, try to hit it out the heel, try and do the opposite of what your fault would normally be. And then after doing that regularly in every practice session, I think you'll find that you'll develop a much better awareness of how to hit the club, how to hit the ball at the different parts of the club, but then more importantly, be able to hit the middle of the club at will. When you want to hit the ball out the middle, you, you know how to do that. Um, so it's not something I can tell everyone to do, but with a bit of practice and a bit of awareness of what a toner heel strike feels like, it's something that you can be really good at it. So your challenge is to dedicate five to 10 minutes in every practice session where you're working on your swing to specifically working on your strike. Okay, give it a go. Let me know how you get on. Um, I'd love to see some examples of people's uh, strike patterns. So if you wanna stick them in the comments, it'll be good to see and um, good luck. Give it a try and I think that's something that will really make a big difference to your game.